Well, this is the superb setting that is the San Siro Stadium. A big welcome to you all to this venue and a welcome to Alan Smith, who's going to join me, Martin Tyler, for the commentary. It's Inter. We're all watching now. Well, disappointing, you have to say, because to be mid-table at this stage, they were hoping and expecting for better things than that. But uh, they've got plenty of time still to turn things around. There's so many characters who could inspire Inter. We've just gone for him today as perhaps one that could give us something special. Well, left foot, right foot. He just caresses the ball, and uh, he's got an eye for a pass too. Wonderful. This is Inter's lineup. Samir Handanovic starts in goal. In attack, Maro Icardi starts. He's been out of sorts lately. This is how the visitors will line up today. And it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager has got an option to switch, maybe go back to uh, four at the back if he wants to. Well, there have been some awkward times for Milan recently. One thing that's never, never decreased is the impact of this stadium. I know they share it, um, but it is a proper football amphitheatre. It certainly is, when it's full. I don't know if make a, a noise, these fans, and uh, the fact they do share it with Inter doesn't seem to detract from the, the atmosphere they do create. Antonio Candreva. Paladino. Paladino. There's some potential in this move. Shots up! Well, he's had a go. Well, if you don't buy a ticket, as they say, and uh, fair play to him for having a crack. Well, this is looking good for the team in the blue and black stripes. Inter. Yeah, I mean, a strong outfit that's used to winning football matches. And I think they're going to add another one to the tally here. Palladino. They've cut the pass out there. And maybe that will ease the pressure. Palladino. Return pass. Just working away to try and find an opening. And the cross comes in now. Stop the cross. He's done well there, defender. Good, strong tackle. Into the attacking third. First touch was poor. It's a quick break. Icardi! Oh, it's a brilliant goal! And it was worth the wait. He's taken the chance very stylishly indeed. And it's given them advantage at last. They've worked hard to get it. Goodness me, they're celebrating it. It's almost as if they drew them onto them so that there was space to break into. And how well they used that space. And that score. He's just got too much pace for those defenders. You can see it. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Rossi.
Well, they're in a good position here. Paladino. It's a neat pass. And it's a shot now. Oh, off target at such a crucial moment. They could have been level. I think the occasion got to him there. All he needed was a cool head, but couldn't supply it. Rossi. Probing away, trying to find room for a shot, maybe. Challenges for the ball. And they're moving forward now with real danger. Inter. Icardi! Well, he scored. And it's a big moment for them in the match. They've pushed their lead now to two ahead. They've played well to this point. And sometimes a two-goal lead can be a dangerous one. We'll see. He took it with great aplomb. I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Paladino. He's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy actually. He's coming forward with some danger. Just a heavy touch, the opposition could take the ball away. Paladino. Not a good challenge by the defender. Keeper comes and claims it, and no great risk. Perisic. Here's a chance to attack. Tackle here. Rossi. Inter now looking for some attacking inspiration. They've opened him up here. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Fourth official has indicated three more minutes. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. They've coped with it well defensively. Well, that's half time. And 2 0 is the score at the halfway mark. Not often, Alan, do you see one man have one half like he's had. On top of his game out there, and I'm sure he'll be thinking about grabbing his hat-trick in the second half. Second half time at the San Siro tonight. Paladino. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. It was good play until they got that challenge in. Good challenge. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Defender to it first. Presented possession to the opposition now. Shot on! He's got to it, and he's claimed the ball too. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Good play. 
But they've lost the ball now, and the opposition can get at them. In to get the throw. Now they do need an injection of uh, fresh enthusiasm from the bench. Antonio Candreva moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here and the cross is in and he goes for goal with his head well the message from the coach is do not sit back keep doing what you've been doing well to be leading in the game We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Could be dangerous. Penalty! Well, well, well. Did you see anything cynical in that, Alan? He just didn't seem to get his balance right there. It was a clumsy challenge. Activity on the bench for the losing team. A substitute getting ready to come off. He's done the job, he's the specialist. Well, there is a saying that uh, things come in threes. They've come in threes for him, a hat-trick. Not just three goals, but he's played really well. His overall game has been top class today. Widen the margin now. 3-0 they lead. Ferrari. Rossi. Looking for an opening with some good control builder. And here's the cross. Stopping the cross. Important job for the defender. I see a substitute coming on for the away team here. And they're moving forward now with real danger. Inter. Real chance, a well saved. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Eva Banega. Good forward play from them. And he's presented the ball to the opposition. Well, he's kept the ball after a good first touch. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. It's a good place to win the ball here. On to the attack now. They've coped with it well defensively. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. Crisp defending there. The shot's on! Oh, well done, the goalkeeper, and he's hung on to the ball. Free kick given. A substitute coming on. It's a tactical change.
Inter now looking for some attacking inspiration. Made the challenge well. Well, they passed their way up into a good position here. And then just lost the concentration. Lost the ball as well. Well, they've got to work hard to try and get it back. Did well, stuck out a foot. Shot on! Credit for taking on the shot. Well, what a good chance that was for him. By his standards, that's the glaring miss. We could be in. He's got his shot off now. And a goal for Inter. Well, here's the man of the moment. Yet another goal for him. He can do no wrong. Some matches, everything goes wrong, but not today. Well, I want to see this again, this goal. Turning out to be a, a comfortable game, this 4-0. Sometimes being a favourite in a match can weigh heavily, expectation and all that. It's not a problem for this team, is it? No, I think their manager will be delighted because they've not uh, taken it easily at all. They've given respect to their opponents, but they've shown the class too. That's a free kick. Well, that can only be down to frustration, the way the game has gone to this point. But there's no excuse for it, really. Well, it's just typical of the way they've gone about the business. They, they haven't played well. They're getting soundly beaten. And now this, what a day for them. Defender to it first. decisions were made by the referee you expected this outcome Alan you did but we don't always get that outcome but credit to the winning team they played with their heads with intelligence they knocked the ball about and they made the opposing team really work what a brilliant performance from this fella yeah one of those matches Martin where everything he touched turned to gold it was an impeccable performance